Welcome back, YouTube. We're doing here throwing the swirl tail jig this morning on the spinner. Um, it's water coming in way high. It must have been from a lot of that rain the other day. We didn't get much rain here locally, but all around us it rained. And it must be got the water backed up and walk them all and PD and stuff backing it up in Black River here. But anyhow, we can see if we can catch a few here this morning. See what we can do with them while it's cool. Ooh, nice yellow perch. As we call them redfin trouts. He sailed on that thing now. Whoa, don't you be trying to cut up and all that. And I'm just trying to get the hook out your mouth. You got it hung good there somewhere. There we go. We got it loose. Little stump knocker. Spotted sunfish, look like a garfish might be done hit him a couple of times there. <laughs> More mouth. Too small, too small. See if there's any bigger ones over there. I ain't been catching them all mouth like you usually catch them. Usually you catch three or four in one spot. Right now, mole mouth bite just ain't real hot. Catch one here and one there. I know last year the bite was hot on them on the spinner later in the summer though. There goes a bigger mole mouth. Big fat belly on you there. Another one of y'all stump knockers. I'll take a few of these fish home, see if somebody around there wants a mess of fish. Give them to somebody. Must be a brim. Here it is. You was a fighter. I don't think I'm gonna keep none today. I'll let them other ones go in a little while. Just trying to get in a video to keep my analytics and stuff up on YouTube there. Trying to keep my channel going. <laughs> Another little spotted sunfish. Y'all sure jump on there when y'all jump on it now. Y'all some fast little fish and y'all run out from that bank so quick. Well, smallmouth bite must be picking up a little bit. This is the most smallmouth we caught in a while. If they ever get to biting. Short stop knock a uh, mole mile. Well, good hand size brim here. This water's coming way high. Got to be all that rain and stuff the other day. It, oh, give me back my grub. 
rained a uh, good bit all around. Here, like I say, it didn't rain a whole lot here locally in my area, but all around us, they got a lot of rain from what I hear. We keep catching one here and one there. Well, we pulled a shell cracker out of there. I probably should have. If I knew the water was going to be this high, I probably should have brought some worms or crickets and used the old brim buster on this high tide. But now later on the day, whenever this uh, water starts going out and it gets down some, bite will probably be a whole lot better than it is right now. It should be about to change because it's almost on a standstill now, so it's probably pretty much dead high tide, but it's coming in so far it's out there in the woods again. But you don't never know till you come down here and check it out. We ain't catching a whole lot, but we is catching a few nice ones. Uh, we switch colors into green and sure truce. <clears throat> we could try hit a little while. See if we switch in colors or get them to bite a little bit better. Like I say, we could try them a while. That sun is about a little bit after 10 o'clock. About 10.30. We'll try them a little while before that sun gets up there too high. See what we can get them to do with this color here. Hey YouTube, this is just going to have to be a short video. It'll be 3 or 4 o'clock this evening before uh, this water gets down low enough for some good fishing and it's getting hot but we could go ahead and we could release these here so that somebody else can catch them and enjoy them or even we'll catch them again but when we come down here next time if we come in the morning times what while this tide's still up like this. We just have to uh, bring the brim buster to where we can get up in some of them shallow places. But anyhow, we come and we tried. Came down here and we tried to catch some and check them out. But you can see that water. It's going out now, but it's still out there in the woods. It's about 11 o'clock. We're we head on in. Hope you enjoyed what little bit of footage we got. And we'll catch you the next time, YouTube.